out there right now in your Facebook, your Twitters. Tell everybody listening to WBLS Radio right now, the session live, every Thursday from 7 to 10 p.m. Out of town, PA, stand up. We create a new empire. Let them know. We got a lot of things going on. Yes, sir. Yeah, I'm going to interview Joel's real quick, and then I'm going to have you. You want to get the instrumentals ready? Oh, what they doing? They riding? Yeah. Yeah, them two going to Yeah, in a little bit. I'm going to do this interview first, then we're going to spit some. All right, you got to come over here when you're done. Let me know what you want to do. Yo. Oh, no, that's not nah, nah. This just ain't like that. <laughs> you got to take that team. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah. You yeah. yeah. said nah, challenge, yeah. challenge, yeah. challenge, yeah. challenge, yeah. challenge, yeah. Yeah. challenge. Yeah. 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 What's up? Oh, oh, what's oh, up? Damn, what's up? Man? What's up? <laughs> See, and that's another thing. See, the etiquette already, he's already up on the mic. So you gotta learn to sit up on the mic a little I do, bit. I do, I you do. I do. I'm tall, man. So, like, my I watch a lot of interviews, man. I'm always watching Breakfast Club and, yep. yeah. um, you know, Rap Radar and, uh, and uh, Drink Champs and all that. So, I'll I be watching. Yep. You gotta stay up on it. Yeah, you gotta so, what's up, Jewels, man? Uh, Mr. Hip Hop Artist, Mr. What's up, man? What's, what's up, man? What's up, in the building? Where are you from out here? Bethlehem. Oh, you yeah, from Bethlehem? Bethlehem. Born and raised, uh, you know, uh, half my life in the north side. You know where Pembroke is at? The project's over there. You grew up in Pembroke? Grew up in Pembroke. Right there on Hilton. Right there in Hilton and Marvin. Exactly so, yeah, at. I was there for half my life. Then we, me and my mom moved over to the south side. We was in South Terrace for, like, eight, nine years. And then we, now nice we're down in the Yasco area. Many basketball yeah. days there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. South so, Terrace. You know, born and raised in Bethlehem. Been there my whole life. Um... Let's talk about this music, though. I got this mixtape dropping tomorrow. Straight to Hustle Nomics. Nomics. Fire ass bars. Just, no, okay. Just hard shit. Like, yeah. not crazy hard, like murdering and all that, but, you know, like, just hot right. shit. Okay. Um, that's right, that's right. Like, um, mixtape release tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah.
I'm like, what? Chuck E. Cheese. 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 Chuck you know, it's, it's love, so... Yeah, but yeah. guys, too, when you're raised over there, because of the fact that they're... Uh, I wouldn't say they're secluded, but they are. It's, it's, you yeah. guys have more, you know, you are more proper. You know, a lot of Allentown... Yeah, that, I, I believe that. that. I believe, a lot of yeah. Allentown cats, I believe like, that. They, they come out talking yeah, too you know, much because they're crazy. They, crazy. Think, <laughs> they think that everything is supposed <laughs> to be for them. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. And that, to me, is like, yeah. where are you going to go with that? Yeah. You ain't going nowhere. You're going to have a bad attitude. Yeah. I, I will always tell people, like, don't always let the music give you, like, a a, 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 con a concept of, you know, who the person is. Because sometimes right. people yeah. just make music. It has nothing to do with them. It yeah. might sound crazy, but when you meet him, he, he, talk, he knows how to talk. He knows how to dress. Like I did the other day. Yeah, I went to one and the dude was talking about uh, uh, <laughs> having cars and jewelry and all this. And I'm looking at him like... Yeah. He had dirty shoes on. You work. You walked here, my dude. He had dirty shoes on. He walked here, my dude. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, I always talk about shit like that. I be going on rants sometimes but on Snapchat, Facebook. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, that's true. You got it, and that's one thing that this game is missing. Which I have a, a company coming out. It's called the Bad Guy. If you can't say it, we will. Because right, right. in yeah, this like game, that. there's a lot of a lot of people getting this information because they're not being straight up with you yeah, like yeah, yeah. i'm gonna tell you straight up you come to me as an artist listen where's your epk if you look at me and tell me what is an epk i just found that out today <laughs> <laughs> so i'm like damn That's like what i'm looking around while you're saying, saying it's like yeah. damn but now nah, just you know like let me get a little bit into myself. You like I've been rapping since the early 2000s, but we didn't. I never went into a studio and recorded nothing. It was just ciphers and house parties, and and I used to do the beatbox at the parties too. So like dudes was rapping on the beats that I was making, and then that made me want to rap. So then, cause then the dudes would be asking me, "Yo, say something, say okay. something." I used to say the same shit every time, and then like eventually I started switching it up, and and it was all freestyle. And once I wrote my first track, I can't. I, I feel like I can't freestyle no more, cause it's like I. I gotta, everything gotta everything sound gotta like, yeah, right. so, like, I'll tell you it's a freestyle, but really, I wrote that shit, like, you know what I mean? Well, that's like, not, not, that, that, not, that's, not, that's, not, that's, not, that's, not, that's what most niggas do, though, they yeah, write yeah. something, they put it on an industry beat and call it a freestyle, yeah, because yeah, it's yeah, not their yeah, beat, yeah, yeah. Or, um, so, like, yeah, so around 2013 is when I really started getting in the studio and recording shit, I was running with a little group called THC, we had a little buzz going, we had, we had t-shirts selling, we had CDs that, like, we, they had, we had people asking for CDs, but we were just so, like, dumb. We were just making songs, putting them on SoundCloud, trying to get as many plays as we could. We didn't know anything. And this time around, you know, I got the right people around me, and everybody trying to do what's right. So we just, you know, we just yeah, trying to make the right team work. is always Yeah, best, that's man. exactly yeah, what you, you can't. You can, the one thing you can't have is yes, man. Yeah, no, yeah. Oh, see, yes, I'm, yeah. I'm that guy that's not, I'm not that guy, because when I'm in the studio with my niggas and they writing something, if yeah. I think that shit is whack, I'm telling you straight <laughs> up. I my niggas you know that, though. Like, they know, and I'm not trying to be a dickhead, I'm not trying to be stupid or nothing, like, I don't think I'm better than everybody in the world, but yeah. when you practice something for a while, you know, you get good at it, and if I was right, like... Nah, I don't write for anybody. Don't write for nah, not yet, at least. Hey, they, hopefully hey, somebody, man, that's that's hopefully trying, somebody yeah. likes something of mine, and you know they want. I was, I, it's crazy that you said that. I was, I was watching an interview last night, Jay Z, and it was like 1998 or something, and he was talking about a few females, big females in the game that he was writing for, and it just blew my mind. I was like, I didn't even know Jay wrote for people like that. Yeah. And and now I'm thinking, who the hell? What big ass song that you know was out that it was, it was Jay that wrote, and one of these shit. females. Blew it up. Yeah, that's what I'm now thinking. Like, what song was it? So he didn't talk about it or nothing. But I would love to ghostwrite for people if they feel in my work. And the, the more I work, I know I get better at it. So, you know, like, uh, you got a stage presence? To. Are you are you just a stand up uh, there rapper? I haven't done too many shows. Like right. like I said, we were just dropping songs on SoundCloud and seeing who thought right, it was even hot. Even when you're in the house party, but I I, 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 I don't feel like I'm house party is. I don't know. I, I'm a little. I'm a little stiff on stage, right? Like, but that's just because I haven't done right, many right, shows. Right, right. So I'm gonna be like that the first three or four. Right. The yeah. first show I did actually was at Casablanca. Me and the, shout um, out to Baby J. Yeah, shout out to Baby J. I knew him since a kid actually, and um, me and this kid Rob Diz from from Bethlehem. We did a show there, and we had the whole club packed. It was crazy, and I actually like. 
I'm, I was cool the whole night. Like I was just, I was nervous up until the DJ first called my name. And once he called my name, I feel like that shit just left. Like, it was like, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna run out the club or something? No. So it just <laughs> left. So right. and I went out there and we did our thing, and it was crazy because most of the crowd knew the words to this shit. So that even pumped me up more. So I, we we had a good time. We still on the spot, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The second show I did, I actually opened up for Mr. Cheeks at um at um what's it called um the club he was working at. Um, um, no, no, no. Damn. Catch twenty two. Catch twenty two. Yeah, yeah he was at. Spot. Yeah, I, um, like two thousand fourteen. Shout out to my whole team. team yeah, Cash shout out to Catch twenty two, man. Shout out to um. um shout what, out to the big name? bro, DJ Menace. Damn, what's the boy's name? Um, TOS, TOS. Um. Shout out to my dude, Bi the Street. Yeah, Bi, Bi, my bad, Bi. Yo, um. But um, he actually got me to open up for Mr. Cheeks with my brother Tony Notes, and we, we killed it, man. That's your brother Tony Notes? Yeah, that's, brother? My, that's, my brother, brother. Like, yeah, that's my hey, older brother. That's my older brother, yeah. Oh, for real? Shout out to Tony Notes. Yeah, shout out to Tony Notes. That's, 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 that's my older brother. Everybody thinks I'm the older brother. Like, brother, like, like brother, same brother? mom, same dad. Oh, I can't even say that. I ain't even got to say nothing. Same mom, same dad. You know what caliber it is. Nah, but yo, you know what? A lot of people in public, a lot of people don't know, though. Like, me and my brother, we're like day and night. We are completely But y'all don't even know. Look alike. Yeah. Ah, I bet you gotta see him. Nah, yeah. You see him next to each other, you probably see it, bro. They we definitely just, look alike. <laughs> you gotta confuse them in the yeah. streets now that you know that they got brothers. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody you know, walk past, everybody you know, be like, like, yo, no, what up? And you're like, nah, that's my brother. <laughs> all the time, all the time. Because we look alike, but. I don't look like that. Yeah, that's my older brother. Uh, yeah, that's Tony Notes out right there. <laughs> He's looking. Oh, that's loud. Yeah, that's yeah. Oh, yeah. So let's get this thing coming. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all, man. Call in number 610-295-5483. Call in right oh, now. Ask us questions. Let's get it live. Call in number 610-295-5483. Call that number, man. Ask me some questions. Bang time. We're all live. But it's 725, man. We about to get into this freestyle. I definitely want to thank you guys for coming through. Yeah, thanks for having me, man. We all part of the family now. You know what I mean? So this isn't going to be last. Time that you're gonna be at this table, yeah. We're even in the studio. I need we're more energy because I need to get that. That's that, about that to go down, yeah. Yeah, 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 just because I'm a radio station, they got what I got. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They don't got what I got. They could be, there's, I think there's three of them around here in the Lehigh Valley now. Yeah. They don't got what I got. They don't got 14 shows. They don't got DJ money bags. Yeah, you know they don't got what I had. So I don't care if they, I got Next TV. Word up. Um, they can put the, another radio station right upstairs, and I could kill up. Yeah. Because it ain't got, it ain't got. Yeah. It ain't the same thing. That's how I don't got my toy job, like. You Something got happened job. with the church that I was working with, right? And um, so I, I decided not to work with them this year. But they were telling me, oh, we gonna, we still going to do it. But I was telling them, all right, you could do it, but it's not going to turn out how it is when I'm involved because right. it's not yeah. me. So not you. I'm not trying to be big-headed, but I put that together. I made right. it what it was. Who so, put like, this thing together? Yeah, me. me. Now, that's who. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> who do Let's I get trust? Who do I trust? Me. <laughs> Nobody. All right, so look. Y'all know what's going down.